I think we just got swag. <laughs> the clothes, London, come on. You can't, also there's a rawness. There's, there's um, I remember my friend Boots saying one thing to me. He said, you know, there's in art, it's it's the downfalls of people and the sadness and, and the imperfections which make everything perfect. And I think British people like to frame their imperfections and let the world see them. And um, I think that's what's great about us as artists. I think that, you know, we, we have that kind of history, we have that musical history and no matter like how far away it gets, um, it will always, I'm getting so distracted, sorry. <laughs> um, no matter how far away from like those bands it gets, we'll always kind of that will always be a part of UK music and we'll always be influenced by it because naturally it's all grown from that. So yeah, I just think we have a well good history. We just smashed it early on. <laughs> You know what? I, I don't know. I think I think it's got a lot to do with pride and like you know that sense of being British. You know, we have the royal family and there's this whole heritage idea that we have. And I think it's really um, it's really lovely that people can touch onto that. You know, and, and how the rudimental boys they have a family vibe going on. And that's you know it's like a heritage. Thing. So I think it's about being proud about what you do. And, and, and I think we do it well. We're so cool. We're just the coolest. We're the coolest people in the world, quite possibly. Yeah. Uh, we're honest. I think honesty is what fans want. People want real. People crave real. And I think that's what people love about British music that we're not perfect and we don't try and, you know, we expose ourselves with a little kind of less fear. So, and I think that's what makes people go, yeah, yeah, you know what I mean? Thank you.